Hi, welcome to this installment of Sugar CRM Tutorials for AtCore Systems. Today, we will look at the search functions within your installation of Sugar CRM. First, we will focus on the global search function and how this scans through all of your Sugar CRM data. Next, we will be searching within a specific module and using that module's advanced search functions to narrow down your results. To finish off the tutorial, we will have a look at saving those searches to save time in the future. So, without further ado, let's get started. First, let's log into Sugar CRM. Right now, we will work on global searches. Once you have logged in, focus on the top right corner of the page. Locate the search box and type some text that you are looking for. Go ahead and press enter or click the magnifying glass. You will now see a short list of results populating a box just below the search box. Select the link from the list. It's as simple as that to do a basic global search. But maybe you didn't see the results you were looking for in the short list. Head back to the search box and enter some text. You will notice that I put a percentage sign after the text that I entered. This percentage sign is also called a wildcard. A wildcard allows you to match a small snippet of text to a larger section of text to increase the number of results in your search. Go ahead and press enter or click the magnifying glass. Now, instead of selecting a name from the list, locate the show all button. Go ahead and click that. When your search returns results, they will be listed here and organized by module. The first module that displayed results for me is contacts. When you find the item that you are looking for, you can click it and be taken straight there. There can be many results listed here, as well as many points of data for each result. For example, in Paris's listing, you will see her name, which takes you to her contact page, the account name, which takes you to the accounts page, an email link, which takes you to an email dialog box to allow easy contact, and also a user page, which takes you to the user who entered this information. For now, let's forge ahead. Going back to the top of the results page, you will notice two boxes. One is titled Enabled Modules, and the other, Disabled Modules. This nifty feature allows you to limit the number of modules that show results for your search. It works as simply as dragging an Enabled Module to the Disabled box, and vice versa. After that, just click Search again. The page is refreshed with the same results, but if you made any alterations to the modules, they will be displayed here. Now let's move on to some more advanced search features, as well as searching within a single module. Go ahead and click on Accounts at the top left of the page. You should now see a page similar to this. Locate the search box and options just below the search header. You can enter a search term here if you would like a basic search of just this module, but we are focusing on more advanced features. Locate and click the advanced search link at the right. You are now presented with a wealth of features. There are plenty of boxes to enter values and really narrow down your results. This is especially helpful if your general search returned a plethora of results. Let's try one now. Go ahead and enter a name in the name box. Since we know the account's email, we'll go ahead and put that in too. Verify that all is correct and click search. Now your results should be narrowed down to a much smaller list. In my case, I received only one result. Maybe we find that this is a search we're coming back to on a regular basis. Luckily, there is a solution for this. While we're still on the search result page, locate the Save Search As box. Just enter some text relevant to the search and click Save. Now as you can see, the search results stayed the same, and the search name that was entered is listed in the Save Searches box. While on the Save Search page, you can make changes to the search. Just enter or remove any selections and click Update. Congratulations! You have successfully completed this installment of searching within Sugar CRM and are well on your way to becoming an expert user. Feel free to come back to these videos anytime that you need a refresher, or if you need any further assistance, then contact your Sugar CRM support staff. Thanks.